<laughs> Reincarnated as a sword, episode 5 is here. Fran has entered the dungeon. However, the dungeon master has conjured a high tier summon, according to them. Just how is this going to play out? Let's find out. I hope you do. You definitely have a challenge at the end of this dungeon, though. Nice, dude. All right, so it looks like the other adventurers are getting inside the dungeon. Oh, nice. Okay. I love the RPG elements in this series, bro, and the vibe of D&D. Nice. I wonder what, uh, what skills those goblins have. <laughs> Made it a little bit easier for them too, huh? Considering she disarmed one of them, literally. Damn, Fran, let's go. I love how teacher's directing her. <laughs> you gotta praise the little cat girl, right? You gotta give her some praise, man. Yeah. Double chant. Let's go, dude. Dude, the AOE attack is on point. Dude, let's go. What a combo, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. Love to see it. Makes sense, yeah. Makes a lot of sense. Bro, look how cool it looks, man. The environment? A perfect dungeon debut. Yo, I love the title of this episode. Echo location? Yo. Got all the detections on lock, huh? Yo, it just shows up all nimbly. That's right. Show them the way. I just love the overall vibe in this series. Like, the dungeon design is cool. I know it's just a cave, but it's still cool looking, bro. Damn. Yeah, Dona ain't playing, bro. She's hiding her her victims, bro. She might have, like, these skills, but she still lacks, like, the overall experience, you know? Compared to somebody like Donda. Damn, bro. She got two, two daggers? Short swords, probably. Gotta protect their king and queen, man. Yo, I love the art style, man. I don't think it's going to be that easy. Let's go, bro. Let's take out the small fries, right? Yo, new OST? Is this a new song? Oh. Because they weren't the actual dungeon bosses, bro. They were able to take them out that easy, though. <laughs> you stole her kill, teacher. You're on the money, teacher. <laughs> so wholesome and adorable, dude. Oh, now you in. Yeah, now you in danger. Oh, what? Yo, those are big, dude. That's interesting, too. They have classes. Okay. Yo, time to get some more skills? Some more levels, dude? Yo, this is so hype, bro. Nice. Dude. <laughs> yeah, right? 30 minutes. There's still a lot of them, bro. You can just keep power level in here. Oh, is that why there's no end of them? There's the head one, the leader. Gotta cut off the, the head, bro. And it keeps summoning its own kin. Very cool, bro. Let's go, Fran. Noise. A lot, dude. Dude. Level 17? What's she getting like five levels? Kin summon. You're gonna summon cats? 
Or swords? Wind magic increased to level 7? Okay. Another door? It never ends, bro. This is so cool. Oh, bro. The killing intent. Yeah, he felt it. Even stronger than that? Believe in your teacher, dude. That's right. I like, Again, I love the overall MMO RPG vibe to it, right? Dude, this is going to be crazy. It has to be the being that we see at the end of the opening credits, right? Oh, she got health regen? Let's go. Extra, yo, extra incentive, dude. Yo, he's gonna bring curry to this world. <laughs> Yo. She's getting fired up, bro. Bro, this is gonna be cool. And we still got like 10 minutes left in the episode, too. There's that core, the dungeon core or whatever. It's gonna be that like winged demon looking creature. Yo. There it is, bro. Is that the same one from the opening credits? Was it like a, an Oni or something? Or like... And the reinforcements can't get in. Yo, this is gonna be cool. I'm already digging this guy's design. Oh, what's he gonna find out? A greater demon. He's an actual demon, bro. He's level 30. Dark magic. Skill taker? Yo, would teacher be able to get this? Even though he takes skills, but maybe like you need this extra skill to take higher type skills, maybe? An entire nation, bro. It just say King of God Chaos or something? Dude, I think this might be a little bit too much for Fran, dude. The voice actor sounds familiar. That's a dungeon master. A <laughs> level 11 rare goblin, bro. Yeah, couldn't the demon just kill him? <laughs> Seems like he's doing so right now. Its staff is really cool. The goddess points of the dungeon core, huh? Oh? What? Well, because you're weak, bro. Is it because he's a king? I would assume because he's a king. Yo, that sword looks cool, bro. <laughs> Dude. Five episodes in and we're getting a fight with a greater demon? I like this demon's voice actor too. It sounds familiar. And this OST! Oh, he's hitting, dude. Nice! She disarmed him. That's not enough, though. He summoned another weapon? Or is it the same weapon? Shadow back. Dude. Yo. Oh, yo. What? What? Dude, what? Oh, thank goodness, bro. Thank goodness, bro. Dude, that was she's scared, bro. Nah, nah. That had to have done emotional damage. Okay. I would think that would wow, it actually didn't phase her. You got over it pretty quick. Damn, bro. Dude's doing like a shadow step or something. This is so crazy, bro. Is it the sword skill? Because the sword had a skill shadow back, which was al allows the sword to go back into his hand. Is it possible that he's using the sword skill to allow himself to also do this? Is he using the shadows? He's used. Okay. He's using her shadow. That's cool, bro. Oh. Noise, Fran. I don't think it's enough, though. Whew. That's some dark energy, bro. 
So she succeeded in poisoning him, bro. It ain't gonna do anything. Dude, better devise a new strategy. And fast. Dude, watch him not watch him not be able to use it. She doesn't want to leave. Yo, Fran is so hardcore, dude. It's gonna cost her her life, though. <laughs> yeah. She wants that curry, baby. Nice. The curry is fueling her, dude. Skill taker. Yo. What? It just stole some of your skills. Extra skill. He doesn't have to even kill the person. Dude, this is not good. That's so dirty. Look how clean it looks, bro. Dude. 